Hey guys, it's Crazy Pickle with another Skyforge guide for support classes Alchemist and Lightbinder. Since there is nothing complicated in rotations for both classes, I decided to combine it in one video. Quickly I'm gonna go over some abilities you're going to use, and then we'll jump straight to rotation part. Alright guys, let's get started. You are going to use Bio Trap, Energy Shower, Stimulate Injection. Also Terminal when needed and Free Slimes every time it procs. Add to that Acidic Solution, your left click, up to 8 stacks and detonate with Combustible Solution, your right click. Use Protective Shell on yourself or a group member when needed. You are going to use Blessing of the Sun, Incarnation of Light. If you get stunned or someone in your group dies inside aura of this ability, it will cancel ultimate ability. Next one is Pulsating Flare on Strongest Player. Flood of Light. Hold your right click all the way. Macavan's Guard. Use right click and then R to drop it. And Sacred Barrier when needed to protect group members around you. Also add to that Unstable Shield use on yourself or your group member when needed. And Rise and Shine to resurrect one group member if needed. Before we jump to rotation, one important thing I wanna say. Alchemist and Lightbinder has to communicate with each other every time you wanna use buff ability. Because when Stimulant Injection wears off, it puts 12 seconds Wearness. Flood of Light and Macavan's right click puts Wearness for 8 seconds. Wearness prevents them from using similar abilities for 8-12 seconds. Both classes can equip Macavan's guard, just let each other know who got their Macavans ready. That's why communication between between those two classes is very important. In the beginning of the fight, you're gonna combine Bio Trap, Energy Shower, Stimulant Injection with Blessing of the Sun and Incarnation of the Light. Also depends on what kind of mission you run. After as a light binder, while Stimulant Injection on cooldown, use Flood of Light when Wearness is off. You can add Macavan's Guard if available. Then you can add Energy Shower if available. Use Stimulant Injection, Light Binder using Blessing of the Sun and Flood of Light. You can also combine Energy Shower, Steams, Macavan's Guard and Blessing of the Sun all together. One more thing, when Impulse Charge procs on Alchemist by using Acidic Solution, your left click, it will reduce cooldown on your Stimulant Injection. Alright, let's recap. Main buff in the beginning. Alchemist, Bio Trap, Energy Shower and Steams combined with Lightbinder's Blessing of the Sun and Incarnation of Light. Secondary buff, Lightbinder, Macavan if available plus Flood. If no Macavan, just Flood. Always pay attention on wariness. Main buff again. Every time Alchemist Steams is ready, use it plus add Blessing and Flood. If Energy Shower is available, you can add that too. After repeat secondary buff again as before, do same thing over and over again until target is dead. Keep in mind that these rotations for the most part best applies to lone fight missions like Distortion slash Avatar. Well, I believed I covered everything or at least basics. Also communication is very important between support classes and entire group, so if you can use voice chat do so. That way your buffs will be in perfect order and sync, which will lead to faster completion of missions you run. Also when Lightbinder used ultimate ability, group members who was inside of aura of 
of ultimate ability will have a debuff for 8 minutes, meaning second use of Lightbinder's ultimate ability will not affect those players who has that debuff. Alright guys, if you like this video, so smash that like button, don't forget to subscribe and activate notification that you won't miss new video I post. You can also follow me on Twitter and Facebook at CrazyPickle7 and join my Discord server, link will be in the description. Until the next time, take care.